So the decision in front of us is, do we buy a, pair, a breeding pair of polar bears that are in good health? And train them up and sell polar bear babies. I'm really tempted by the idea. They're such they're bad haulers though because of the filth that they create. And I think they're pretty wild. Also, what what temperatures can they handle? 40 to negative 55. Ah, it just seems like an interesting thing to play with. Takes a big chunk out of our money supply. Um Ah, let's go for it, though. Polar bears, get into animal. Haul. Haul. And hopefully they make us polar bear babies. Uh, why is this fungus not getting... refilled? I guess just no one is... Wait, what's it set at? Oh, it's set at normal. Set it at important. And then this one is also set. Wait, they should be able to be set at normal. Because there's nowhere else for them to for it to go. I think feeding the animals, though, is more important. Let's... Flynn's almost got this room under control. Flynn, can you just demonstrate to me that the fungus hauling works and it's just that no one in our colony is hauling anymore? Yeah, it is. I don't like that we can't specify what uh, what they're doing. Um, we can't specify what food is given. I'm going to do that and that, and then we'll deconstruct these two. Young's certainty has fallen from 21 to 18, and he resents the conversion attempt. I know Young, but... All right, Psychic Soothe was very generous of the game. But yeah, we're we're hurting on haulers at the moment. Uh, steroid. Talk to me. Okay, you're you're in for you're in for a pound, in for a penny. What are you wearing? Oh, just normal stuff. All right. Uh, smoke leaf joint should make you right as rain. I think for the time... Ah, no, that's that would be a mistake. I was considering... Uh, selfless Hunter. I was thinking about uh, offering up the animals the ability to roam down here. They just don't have a good access point for it. Can get rid of that. We're not putting chem fuel in there. Like, maybe we make a, we make a cut-in through here so that animals can come in here and graze openly. Actually, that's a pretty good idea. So, well, other animals are going to get in too, though, now that I think about it. That's probably, that's probably a bad idea. Um, we've had enough problems with lots of animals getting into our, into our stuff. So we'll just leave it like that. Psyched we have some polar bears, though. Hopefully I haven't made a terrible mistake and they come in handy. This room is absolutely horrifically disgusting. <laughs> um, okay, and the caravan spot, though, I'm going to build a copy of it here. Deconstruct this one over here, and, uh, and we will eventually figure out how to put some straw matting down. Maybe we should do that before we run out of straw. Yeah, that could be a good idea. Uh, what's it called? Yeah, straw matting. Let's do that. A 
I'll just build a little bit of a roof there too. And that's fine. The, the trees don't grow, so I'm not bothered by it. Zone. I want to check out the animals zone and just remove this part. There's no value in them, like, wandering back behind there, and it looks a little funny. Just means that they're harder to find when white needs to do the taming. All right, our power surplus is looking good though. So, and we've got all our neural superchargers going. Four components. I think I, I'm better spent on, those are better spent on sleep accelerators at this point. So I'm gonna put one here on Flynn and Valentin's bed and then one on Edie's. Because we get two for one on this one. And Flynn, what are you up to? You're making flak jackets? That's exactly what I was gonna ask you to do. You're a genius. And then Valentin is like just hauling things. Yikes. It's the endless bug parade. I didn't realize how much work those huskies were doing. We need to get these bears trained up. Seems to be going relatively fast, and yeah, white has a burning passion for it, so white's going to be psyched. Are we officially out of steel? Looks like it. We have not collected all that there is. Wendy, grab some steel and just go put it away, just so we have some on hand. We have a lot of places to mine for more steel. Uh, it's just going to be a matter of doing it. Oh, this room is shockingly not awful. Uh... This is just to make the environment slightly less hideous since we might be spending a lot of time there. Uh, not going to take the refugees. We're going to get some wall lights going in here as well. Space is already occupied. Oh, it's, it's one of those. Got it. Um... All right, we'll just put the other one there because these haven't been smoothed yet. We have plenty of steel. It's just not getting hauled. And also, when did we become wood barons? Ah, so they're the sleep accelerators, accelerators operating. <laughs> they're pretty cool. It means that people wake up earlier and... I believe, no, I mean, it does mean that they get to the neural superchargers fast. Uh, ooh. Flynn, Flynn needs some bionics also at some point as our master crafter. <laughs> Steroid got the plague. <laughs> I can't help but laugh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, steroid. I mean, not really. I'm not very sorry. But wow, we've made great progress on this as well. Um, wait, why didn't that expand to there? Oh, there we go. Good. So these, this room is completely done. This room is almost done. But poor steroids life is is never complete although steroid you know for for all of steroids terribleness uh steroid will eventually be a pretty awesome uh backup uh backup medic and crafter and cook like they're actually a pretty good pawn we've been using them for horrible things uh but Just 
get that clean. We really, we need, actually, let's put Wendy on cleaning again. Wendy's becoming my new cleaning person. Because uh, it gives her a break from other things. Um, so the refugees that are expiring, which is fine. Now we could tame some boomalope. Ah, yes, train them with fungus. That is exactly what we like to see. Training's going pretty well over here. We might see hauling start to be a thing. Ooh, hauling is pretty good on the grizzly bear. The grizzly bear is going to go into the husky zone, and we're going to see how bad this is. Because we need, we need the hauling help. At some point, I think we're we're also going to start tapping into our food supply. Um, we can always eat. Uh, Maker's Shack of Fortune. A medical skill trainer. There may be an unknown threat. Okay, we can start thinking about some of these things. Uh, component mining site. That's a lot of value right there. Seven people, though, is a lot of people. Since we don't really have a great, a great war group. Major break risk, steroid. What have you taken lately? Only smoke leaf. Oh my gosh, wait a second. You have the plague. What am I doing to you, steroid? You're only just barely beating the plague, too. I can give you better medicine. Uh, and probably also, let's... I care about you enough to prioritize bed rest on you, steroid. Um... Go rest, my dude. Oh, why are we running out of power? So those dang sleep accelerators. Okay, we have more than enough steel available. It's just not currently in the appropriate locations. Components are getting a little dicey. We're going to have to turn the fabricator on at some point, but we got to get our power sorted. Crisis of Belief Gen. Okay. Oh, you're ravenously hungry. Is there a reason no one's feeding you? I'm not sure why no one is feeding you. Wow, you just hate everyone, though, as a side note. Valentin is unrestricted. Flynn is working. Young is cooking. Uh, oh, Wendy, you've probably cleaned enough, haven't you? I think whoever's going to be our janitor is always going to be at the far end. <laughs> um, ooh, a good large sculpture. Let's make the room slightly more impressive. We should probably make two more batteries at some point, too. We need to deal with this as well. Uh, Valentin. It's time to time to deal deal with this. Hey, bears, don't wander into the grenades, please. Oh, that was close. Okay. Let's, let's fix the animal zone so that I can do this without constantly fearing for 
blowing up one of our pricey polar bears. Um, yeah, stay over, stay over there, please, polar bears. Thank you. I thought White was about to immediately run in and just be like, hey, how's it going? So grenades have a one radius, uh, one radius miss threshold. So they will, if as long as I aim here, they will never hit the wall. Uh, all right, that's good enough for now. Um, Young is at nineteen percent. Young, oh, let's let's do this. Five point two. <laughs> I thought we were going to get there on that one. Okay, there is enough food in there. Nobody should be hungry. Oh, we got some some yak. Let's uh let's top up our meat supply. I don't remember who has I'm expecting Valentin to do the work. They were so conveniently located until... <laughs> yeah, those are some juicy, some juicy corpses. Valentin, what did you go decide to do now? Sewing fungus? Okay. Okay, so Flynn, you're you're making lots of things, but I think that it is time for us to uh upgrade those and also for research. Let's get the tube television. It's one of the best forms of uh one of the best forms of entertainment. Um, actually, what do hospital beds cost? Hold on. It didn't even occur to me. I think they cost components. Yeah, and we're... Yeah, we're in rough shape on components. So we're gonna... We're gonna hold off on hospital beds as much as I wanted to. Oh, and these are generating power, but... That power is not contributing to the grid. Uh, that was a waste. Bear, I want to see you hauling something. Do you only haul once you're at 7 of 7? The questions that plague us. steroid wow I was not I was not tracking that at all I'm glad steroid is okay as much as I pretend that I don't care about him and sometimes he is awful uh <laughs> and Valentin is slowly moving I presume moving stuff up here yeah we did get a low shield pack at some point Actually, someone should carry that. Who should carry that? Someone who doesn't have anything else. Seems like a good thing for Mule to carry. Well, actually, Flynn, you don't have anything, do you? Yeah, Flynn, you're the perfect person to carry the shield pack. Where'd it go? There we go. If we get into a bad place, the shield pack will allow us to drop it uh, and protect ourselves. Um, I don't like the pathing on the way Valentin is doing this, but that's neither here nor there. Major break wrist. Steroid. Welcome back. Missed you. Uh, you have a psychite tolerance, so t take your joint. It goes... 
Ah, uh, well, that's... That serves me right for being like, it goes to show how effective uh, drugs can be medicinally in this game to uh, to control uh, mood, but... <laughs> Wait, steroid, why are you back up again? I just rescued you. <laughs> and you're going back in. Oh no. <laughs> All right. Well, I hope you go pick up, at least pick up your Ambrosia. Combat supplier. Okay, this is perfect. This is what we want. So we reconnect this so that all of this stuff is in play. And then Edie calls the ship. And hopefully we can sell a bunch of tainted apparel. Uh, no? Can you not sell tainted apparel? This is an interesting question. I thought you could. I'll sell that flak vest because it's mostly used up. We can sell them some insect jelly. I don't really care to have it. Uh, we need the components. Are we out of medicine? No, I think it's just not. Uh, it's not in our stores. And we have a reinforced barrel. That's all fine. We're not going to sell the heavy SMGs. We should get an EMP grenade. That's that's an easy an easy take. Um, do you have anything of poor quality? No, awful quality. Hmm. All right, I think we I think we do that, but we're running out of uh, running out of silver. I guess we can mine up some more. Uh, hmm. Always sad when I see steel there. Oh yeah, that was another thing I wanted to do actually. We put a slate shelf here. Let's put two of them. I want to I want to put our drugs here so they're easier to find. Uh oh, dark fiesta expected. Yes, let's do the dark fiesta. Why are you eating Insect jelly. Oh my gosh. Steroid has just been on a on a rampage. Uh <laughs> Steroid is just not doing well. What's a uh... Oh, that's that's Wendy. Okay, so the plague's still messing with you. You got a little bit of that action. Uh are we going to do the party without steroid? I guess it's only for Tugas anyways. All right, let's 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 give this a go and hope that uh, all goes well. Is the Dark Fiesta? Yeah. Here it goes. Everyone can be part of it, so... Groovin'. Come on, unforgettable. That's what we want. Fun. All right, it's a mood bonus. This bear has to be fully trained, right? Almost. Well, it is doing work. So we love to see that. Um, did that, oh, no one picked up these components. I feel bad, but I feel like Mule is the person that I always send to move things. Uh, all right, so this I want to be for smoke leaf joints and psychoid T. Uh, Ambrosia needs to be refrigerated, I believe. 
So this, I for now, I'm going to let this be EMP, uh, not EMP shells, but EMP grenades, and also the sniper rifle, a sniper rifle. So we have those handy. I guess we need to keep uh, steroid. Can't you just like take it easy for a minute? I know I've like I've cursed you with the fungus, but also Valentin, can you just like I just need I need someone to haul these chunks because they're not getting hauled otherwise. Uh, did I just like stop your breakfast? No, you have food and rest, so you're good to go. Valentin is by far the safest hauler. Um, okay. Combat supplier has left range. Is this currently on or off? Currently on. So let's flip the switch. We're generating enough power, I believe. I just want to get a better dining room table. Steroids just vomiting everywhere. And can't clean it up because it's outside of the area of fungus. So I guess maybe I was wrong and maybe you can't sell tattered apparel. That's worth Googling. Uh, Rimworld, specifically. Hmm. We'll have to check that next time. Major break risk. Steroid, always. Smoke leaf tolerance. Take some... Consume some ambrosia. Oh, you're moving so slowly. Yeah, so steroids consciousness is in the... Wait, hold on. Are you hungry? Yeah, eat this lavish meal before you go to bed, and then please don't throw it up. Okay, let's check the training on our polar bears. Zero of seven here, zero of seven here. Making better progress on this one. Uh, how about middle stage pregnant? Good. Hey, Valentin. Just get that room to be slightly less awful, please. We must have a lot of cloth, actually. Yes, we do. Yeah, we need a bulk goods trader to liquidate some of our assets. You know, I appreciate I appreciate his... Uh, Go get it attitude. You don't need to eat anything, do you? No, you don't. Okay, well, just throw up again. <laughs> okay, we got the we got the tube TV done, and I might actually get this preemptively. I'm going to reinstall this here. So I'm going to shift it over one. And then the idea is if we put a TV here, these three beds are all going to be able to... The Arco Nexus. Not anytime soon. If we set that to good, hopefully the sniper rifle that gets delivered will be the right one. Young? I don't want you making art. No, definitely not. Uh, only Wendy should be making art. There we go. Cancel that. Go do other things, Young. <laughs> and then Wendy. I know I just told you to do art, but you're going to be on cleanup duty. Actually, I'm going to have Valentin do cleanup duty, too. We're going... I want to get this place spick and span. 
Young is going to become one of us very shortly. I hope. Okay, so with this done, uh, I'm going to put a vent there. We're going to put a cooler in here so we can refrigerate uh, our insect corpses. And we'll also finish digging this out. Okay. Good news about a flash storm is there's very little to light on fire. The sun blocker has basically taken it all away, anyways. Do we finally have some marble? Just 58 blocks. Has no one... Okay. Bad news. Bad timing, I should say. Uh, we only have three shells. I hadn't started making shells yet. Uh, okay, um, so everyone stay inside, and Wendy, you're riding pretty high, so man the steel mortar. Um, but turn off fire, uh, hold fire so we can get this sorted out. Are they here yet? Oh, here they are. Okay. Is it just me or do they all look... Okay, where are they located? All right, they're located over there. So Valentin, uh, I think your best bet is to come up here. Oh, but not that way, please. Wait, where the heck are they going? I thought this was a siege. Okay, please slow down. Okay, so... I want to find the people that are building the mortar and kill them. But doing some other work in the meantime is fine, too. Okay, it looks like McFly is the one building this mortar, so... Wait for them to come back. Come on, get it. Oh. Good hit. Where's the shaman? Of course, they're on the wrong side of the map to help. You got this, Valentin. We need to get Valentin a bionic eye to make this easier. Uh... fire not a good shot oh don't like that okay hold on a second wait Wendy where'd you go you wait you just you fired one shell and you were done Who's utilizing this mortar? Rico's repairing it. Valentin, come on. No nearby unreserved shells? What? What do you mean unreserved shells?
Oh, are they? Okay, they're not inside. There we go. And then this one, we're going to force the target. Okay, we have to wait until... We could get a shot in edgewise, please. Let's just see if we can hit anything. Good hit. Okay, that one looks more centered. Okay. Do that again, Wendy. Okay, here comes our first mortar. Oh, our biorefinery. <laughs> Are you currently using the mortar? Who's currently using the mortar? Don't mess with our polar bears. I tell you what. Yeah, okay, you are. Hey, Valentin, if you could... Oh, that's actually going to make things a lot more complicated. Um... Are you absolutely kidding me? Shot to the heart. That's devastating. Is that shield going to block that? Nope. We're out of shells, too, so I can't even believe it. I really need this to just trigger the, the raid. These, if this shaman tribe could just like run into them, like engage, that would be fantastic. Oh, are you really going around? <sighs> Gonna try and get Valentin into the freezer. I don't even know what to do right now. Um, completely at a loss. I should have had Valentin in flak armor for sure. What a f Foolish mistake. There goes our hospital. <sighs> oh, you couldn't just hit them? Please do that. We lost our jump pack. We lost Valentin, most importantly of all.
That's not a person to shoot at. Well, Jen just got busted out of prison. This is not going very well. Are they leaving in a way that they're going to engage? All right, looks like they are. They may not win, though. Um... needs rescue. Rescue them. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I assume they're going to come around this way. White has the wrong gun. Okay. <sighs> well, a lot of the loot that we would have gotten is lost by uh, by that, but let's take a look at what we got here. A hardworking psychopath. Incapable of dumb labor, no. Too smart, tough, and kind. With a high construction skill, but a low shooting skill. Um, it was devastating. Um, Valentin's death is hitting me real hard right now. <sighs> Wait, why is Young injured? Do you get hit by a mortar too? No, gunshot wound. Okay. All right, well, losing the rocket pack hurts, uh, losing Valentin hurts exceptionally. But these are the lessons that the rim teaches you. Oh, come on. Not having a moral guide is going to ruin the eulogy. <sighs> That's a little a little punishing as well. Medical emergency on Jen. Jen bleed out. I don't care. Mule? Are you joking me? Young doesn't need his bed right now. Where are you sleeping? On a hydroponics bed? Don't do it. Oh, white, you too? Wait, who is that? That's white. Why are you sleeping on the floor, white? 
はあ、All right, well, I'm going to call it here. And that's going to be it for today.、Uh, thank you, everyone who swung by, and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.